Yeah, we got a nasty storm coming right now, so I wanted to give you a quick update on my raised beds. They came yesterday while the workmen were working on the yard. All right, I'm underneath the umbrella now in the decompression area. So I ordered two. Just wanted to give you a quick update. And um, sometimes it, this week we'll be putting them together and planting up some veggies. Nice storm coming. We can use that water. Oh, yeah. I love it. Love the sound of rain. Okay. Raised beds will be uh, put together soon. And we're going to pot up some veggies. Happy growing. Okay. Same day. We just had a, a nice rainstorm down here in South Florida. April 30th, about 2.52 in the afternoon. It's... Excuse the mess, but I had to pile everything in there in order to finish my newly renovated area. We painted the, uh, the little fence yesterday, or they last night. Now they have to seal those cracks. We got certain cracks in the uh, in the wood down there. We got to seal it with some with some of uh, this is what they bought. I hope it works. They're going to seal that wood with this. Yeah. To preserve the wood, to keep it from from rotting. Well, I hope it works. If not, then we'll we'll just replace replace the fence. But uh <clears throat> Excuse me. I really came out to take a look at that Seattle Orchid, Orchid Hall. I left out in the rain. I knew we were going to get some water today, but I didn't know how much. So I left them on the on the garden bench. And uh, we'll see what they're doing. Oh, God, the box fell and everything is on the ground. Okay, so here they are. Oh, okay. This is a little supposedly established orchid in a pot. <laughs> right. Okay, you're missing a pseudobulb there. You're missing a pseudobulb there. You're missing a pseudobulb there. Huh. Uh, let's see if we can find some eyes, maybe. From what I can see, uh, no eyes unless these little broken off pseudobulbs produce eyes. Maybe that's a tiny eye. Right in that sheath. Okay, whatever. That's him. We've already done this, but this is after the rain. And this is that supposedly established media. Hmm. All right, this is another. I guess that's ampersinin. It could be something else. Who knows? Yep. Uh, broken pseudobulb. Another broken or rotted pseudobulb here. <laughs> okay, a little dead leaf there. Hmm, another dead leaf here. Interesting. Uh, so far, out of the camera, I guess that's an eye. Look, look how the roots are ripped. Look at the roots are ripped off here. That's that's terrible. Look like they, who knows what they did. That could be something. I don't know. I don't know. I have no idea. That I, I'm guessing. But that supposed it me and my little whatever it is they want to call it. Oh, I forgot to show you this part. They, I guess they tore that off because it was probably looking so bad. It was probably looking like this leaf but worse, so they tore the tip off to ship it. <laughs> okay. And um, I knew this was coming as a plug, but I didn't know it was coming with yellow or dead-looking leaves. You understand what I'm saying? I had no idea. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I need this information so I can send it to American Express. 
they told me to video exactly what I have. Absolutely. Okay, that's that, Darwiana. And this is another a Clandii variety Alba cross with soap. Okay, uh, if you want to call this established in a net pot, I say it's a plug actually in a net pot. It grew, it looked like it did grow. Oh, it actually has a growing tip. My goodness. This one actually has a growing tip. Okay, there's a broken off pseudobulb there. It looks like it's trying to produce a new root, which is good. Looks like another root there. It's trying to establish, trying to get it to focus. See, there's, there's no sun. We just had a, had a storm. So, a lot of them have a lot of, there's a broken leaf there. Yeah. Yellowing tips. Okay, so, enough of that disappointment. I don't know, my green thumb, you know, you know, you guys know me. I could take a weed and grow a tree. So, I'm still very dissatisfied with them and they'll no longer be getting any more of my money. Okay? And if they die, well, they're not dead now, so who knows? The only one I'm worried about, I think, is the one with the bad yellowing. And see, these leaves are, are yellow around the border, really yellow. And this bad looking mess here with the spots. I don't know. What did they do? Douse it with fertilizer and just burnt the leaves. Who knows? But um, see this thumb here? It works miracles. So we're gonna we're gonna suck it up as a awful experience with Seattle. Now I'm waiting for Hauserman. I have never had any issues with Hauserman, but COVID is in town, and you just never know what you're gonna get. Okay, I see something in the garden. I'm going to add a twist to take me out of this funk of losing money. Bad investment. And uh, lesson learned. <laughs> okay, this is what I see that I'm trying to get to over here. It looks like one of my Vanda uh, leaves are trying to open. And this is a, uh, oh my God, what's the name of my, what's the name of that, that band? Okay, it's over here. I got another one. Okay, it's hanging right here. Whatever this guy's name is. Okay, Vanda Denisoniana, but it's not crossed with Goodfellow. It's just Vanda De Denisoniana. Okay, and it looks like, uh, it's trying to open its buds. So we'll come back. I have bud blasts on one, oh, right there. There's some bud. Oh, it's gone. So the others are trying to open. So we'll come back after this rainstorm because they really need it. It's been a while. I'm going to leave the that uh, Seattle, uh, whatever you want to call it, hall. <laughs> Disappointment. capable of bringing it back. So, for now, I'll focus on what I have and be thankful for what I have. Happy growing.